it's frustrating that it's called a dyslexia screener uh, because schools cannot diagnose dyslexia, but it does give us information about whether or not a child may have learning difficulties. And with that information, then schools can say, okay, this is a child that we might need to have, you know, pulled into a reading group during that RTI time or during classroom instruction. We really want to be paying attention to this child's phonological awareness or their phonic skills or their reading fluency. Are they pulling it all together and reading in such a way that it isn't choppy? Because as we know, if you can't read fluently, then you can't comprehend. So with that information then, Schools are using that to support students, but schools are also required, if a student is flagged on that screener, to reach out to families and communicate that. And then they also communicate what is the plan for supporting that student. 